Okay, so the votes are in, and um, I asked if you guys prefer a talkover um, with this or if you're just here for outfit inspo, and literally the results were 50-50 last time I checked. They could be one way or the other at this point, but I got to get this video recorded, so I'm trying something new, and I hope you enjoy it. So, if you live in California like me, then you know that you can still wear shorts in fall. We're halfway through October at this point and I can still wear shorts and the days don't look like they're cooling down to like a cold temperature anytime soon. Even in like 70 degree weather you can wear shorts. So I wanted to first put together a shorts look. So I chose these black Levi's that I got over the summer. I paired it with this ribbed cream colored top that I got from Amazon I think and then to give it a little more of a fall vibe and if the weather does get a little chilly out this plaid print blazer that I wore all the time last fall is perfect and to complete the look I went with the Chelsea platform boots that I have I got these last winter and they were definitely a splurge or like a spoil myself for some reason moment and I'm so glad I did because I wore them nonstop. A look like this is great for a casual dinner with friends. Probably it shouldn't wear this to work unless you're working from home. But if you're going to work, unless you can wear denim shorts, then go for it. But if not, I would save this for just a casual date night look or a fun weekend look. Probably not something I would wear to pick apples in or pumpkins. But I would definitely wear it out to dinner with Drew. Next, for something pretty similar, but a little more dressy, definitely, I threw on this slip dress from ASOS along with this super oversized black blazer, also from ASOS. And I feel like the boots with this look just make it so cute. Like, my favorite look ever. This is definitely my style. Um, I feel like I'm a mix of, like, edgy and classic, and I feel like that's what this is. Also trendy. The oversized blazer is definitely trendy right now. So I feel like this look just all together is me. It's definitely me on a fancier date night, which I'm really looking forward to doing soon. And I just love it so much. I also think this look is perfect for like a holiday party. The holidays are coming up. I don't know if anyone will be attending any parties or not, but something like this is really cute. Again, because it's edgy, but dressy enough. You can even swap out the boots for heels, but we're styling Doc Martens today, not heels. So I would stick with the boots and just keep your look cool. Okay, so moving on to my next pair of Docs. I forget the exact name at the moment, but they do have a gummy heel on them and they go a little higher up the ankle. They're so comfortable once you break them in. If you have a pair of Docs, you know they take some breaking in. But once you do, they're perfect. I love these ones because the color is so unique. Last fall when I got these, I got stopped all the time with people asking me where I got them because they love the color and I couldn't agree more. It's like the perfect beigey taupe color. So to style these ones, I switched it up. Obviously I've already, if you go look at my Instagram feed from last fall, you'll see that I've styled these a bunch of different ways already. But to give you some other ideas, I wanted to pair these high top ones with this white skirt from Zara and this super cozy teddy cropped sweatshirt. It has like elastic in it, so I just tied it tight and then tucked it to give it a little bit of a cropped feel. If cropped shirts aren't your thing, feel free to do the opposite. I feel like this is such a cute fall look, especially if you're more on the preppy side. I probably wouldn't lean more towards this look, but I would wear it. Like I said earlier, I definitely lean more towards edgy looks. But that doesn't mean I don't like a preppy look every now and then. And I feel like the cool thing about Doc Martens is they bring a little bit of edge to pretty much any look. Okay, next I wanted to show you how to pair Doc Martens with trousers. I chose these light colored ones that I have from Zara and I thought trousers would be a good one to do. I know there's probably some of you out there who still need to wear some sort of a slack. So to help you out, I'm pairing them with the taupe colored docks. And like I said earlier, I definitely lean towards more trendy looks. And since I'm working from home right now, I had to throw a little bit of trend in there for this look. So I threw on this knit set. It's actually like a knit tank top and this matching cardigan that goes over. I got this from Zara a few months ago and 
if you're anywhere on Pinterest and you're into fashion, I'm sure you've seen people tie the little sweater diagonally like this. You can also do over both shoulders. Um, I like the look of this. I feel like it gives just like a fun detail and again, it's trendy and I like that. But it's also classy at the same time. If this isn't something you're into, you could totally wear the cardigan over it. Or if it's hot out, you can just wear the tank by itself. But that's probably not too work appropriate. Maybe it is. I don't know where you work. Just trying to help you out. And last but not least, we have the Oxford styled docks that I got last year as well. I chose to go with the platform ones. They do come in like the regular style, but I love a platform. So I went with this style and I think they're so cool. I've worn them a lot and I was kind of afraid that I wouldn't get that much wear out of them. But what I love most about these ones is that they're almost like a dressier sneaker. They don't look like sneakers, but they're like just a step up. Like if you wanna go kind of casual, like I would totally wear this outfit with sneakers, but when I pair it with these docks, it just dresses it up slightly, which is funny because all I've been saying throughout this video is wear docks to dress your look down, which these could dress down a look as well. I just feel like they're the perfect like balance and I love them so much. So to style these ones for you guys today, I chose my black Zara jeans, a black crop top, and this heavy, I'm like getting hot in here, this heavy flannel from ASOS. I need to look at the brand, but I just got it and it's so comfortable. I also like it because I can wear it as a dress with these, like that would look so cute minus the pants. Okay, minus the jeans. Okay, can't get sidetracked, I'm losing my breath. I have to say that out of all the outfits I've styled, um, this one is the most me, at least currently. They're all me and I would wear all of them, but this would probably be my number one choice. 